Dixie Chicks became early victims of cancel culture when country music stations dropped them for trashing President George W. Bush on stage. Now they're back on country radio and Taylor Swift's new song, Soon You'll Get Better. And a lot of people, <laughs> for some reason, who probably weren't even alive then, are not happy about it. <laughs> Do they need to get past this? Even George Bush has gotten past it. He's That's painting true. pictures of cats. <laughs> <laughs> he doesn't even care anymore. <laughs> you know how many singers have said far worse things, though, about Trump and are still outperforming? This was at a different time in our this country's very different history. Time. And, and I think we now look back in the past. I, for one, I'm not a fan of artists getting overly political because I just want to listen to their music. No. Uh, not everyone agrees with me on you that. You can do but both at the same time. They are more than welcome to share their views and let the free market do what it will. But to, mm. to totally cancel them and say you're not allowed to sing anymore. I was listening to Spotify and, and Taylor Swift. They're singing one of her songs with her now. Mm -hmm. I think that's part of their comeback. Yeah. I think they're great, but... You know. I know. It's, it's interesting because um, for, for those of you that don't remember, it was, I think, 2003, was it? And it was during the, the war. And, and um, the lead singer said, just so you know, we're on the good side with y'all. We do not want this war, this violence, and we're ashamed the president of the United States is from Texas. That's what that she did. said. That one. Well, she, she then, did it in overseas when she was yeah. performing in England. And I think... Um, and it was about the Iraq war. It the, was right the, before the, the war started. Yeah. yeah. And... Well, I if I ever leave the country, you will never hear me criticize any America's perfect and nothing bad ever happened. That's just how I was raised. Unless of course you're the I president. Do. Uh, no, I'd say how me, yeah. Megan, yeah. does yeah. it. Exactly. No, yeah. again, they were in London. You don't yeah. have to do it. You, like yeah. this is just how yeah. I. D it's just yeah. how I was raised and what I believe. Um, I love the Dixie Chicks, though, and I Great think girl. it's time to move on because that was over ten years ago, if not yeah. longer. And they performed this version of Daddy's Lessons with Beyonce mm -hmm. at the CMA Awards, I believe. That is incredible, yeah. and they're beautiful artists. And I think yeah. art is political. I don't agree with what they did, but I think they've more than atoned at this point. Well, and we, I would. At this point, how can you hold music. them? How can you continue to hold them to a, a level that the guy who's supposed to be yeah, running the country yeah. does not hold himself yeah. to? So, and she apologized. You know, so yeah, well, but, 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 but even if she her apologized, her name's Natalie Maines. You yeah. know, even if she apologized, you know, ten years is a very long time, and things change. And she can still be miss angry. But the beauty of America, yeah. the it's beauty always was, you had the right to do that. Yeah. You had the right. <laughs> now, you know, unless we're changing all the policies to make it so you can't criticize or say anything, but that's a different country. That's not the country I was raised up in, so you know something's going to have to change for me. Because, yeah. you know, it'll come out of my mouth and be like, well, I used to be able to have freedom of speech. No, but speech. I think we're going to look back 10 years from now, like we are in this moment, and say we haven't done everything right. Maybe we were too PC. Maybe we were this cancel this culture. Isn't, this isn't even PC. This is, this is general, if, you hold, if you hold people to a standard. You have to hold everybody to that standard. And if you're not going to hold him to that standard, then you need to lighten up on what you mad at the Dixie Chicks about. Because some of the stuff that's come out of his mouth yeah. overseas We're is just like... I refer you... You know. Yes. Yeah. It was a huge scandal. Google the, Google the Helsinki meeting and you'll see what she's talking yeah, about. It just, yeah. It's, you know... It's, well, he's they're, they're one of the great country music are, artists you know? of, a, of a generation and I love their music. I still do. Yeah. And I a lot of people agree with yeah. what they back. said now. Well, in retrospect... Times, well, times change. Well, it's like times the theme change. Of so everybody grow up. It's the same yeah. with the... Vehicle. We'll be right back. All right. <laughs>